Who are you? Next act is an experimental meta character act. Where'd they go? Involving oh. hypnotherapy and madness? Oh, I'm not quite sure how I feel about that. As Michael Haycock, Jesse Marcus, and a oh, what? Wait. Yes. <laughs> Why is it that I got the first name wrong and the last name right? <laughs> Questions. But they bring you Braille Probe. Braille Probe! <laughs> hurtful labels like qualified <laughs> and hurtful labels like allowed. <laughs> they are meant to exclude, and that is not what we, Brain No Pro, are all about. My name is Dr. Alan Schmenkelman, and I have been using my skill set for years on nine separate occasions. The FBI has asked me to stop phoning in ticks. <laughs> Hello, my name is Dr. Patrice Fontaine. I direct local children's theater productions. I'm a part-time cryptozoologist, and I got my therapy degree from a Stevens Henneke College. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, my name is Theodore, and for copyright reasons, I am not allowed to disclose my last name. <laughs> uh, I got into therapy uh, after I got in a coma from a Rubik's Cube accident and spent six months inside of myself. Whoa! We visited him every single day. We'd walk in, we'd say, Theodore, you don't know this, but we love you. And then one day, months later, he awoke and said, I love you too. And, and we it, said, fuck off, Theodore. <laughs> and we've been friends ever since. It's true. And what we're going to do now is help solve someone's mental problems. Who has a problem? Who here does not feel like they're in a good mental state? Raise your hand. Hey, yeah. you do yeah. not feel like you're in a good mental state. Who else does not feel else? like you're in a good oh, mental the state? The mermaid? Yeah, yeah. Why so are you so fucking crazy this yeah. fucking crazy? <laughs> 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 who, are we gonna, who should we fight against? So I don't know. I'm just gonna go <laughs> sniff one out. Oh, Lord. Oh, be careful. Oh, you can't spell it. I don't worry about me, you goddamn freaks. <laughs> <laughs> Mom? We have a problem. <laughs> Denial. <laughs> that's, a serious problem. That's, the worst, that's the worst fucking denial I've ever seen right there. Would you allow us to help you? Get up here! <laughs> right now, who is your name? Rachel! Yeah. Rachel! Rachel. <laughs> have you ever heard of a Rorschach ink blot test? Yeah. Okay, did you happen to bring any with you? Does anyone have a Rorschach ink blot test? <laughs> Goddamn useless! Oh, <laughs> I see a tree, but it says apple. That's fucking useless. <laughs> Tell you what we're gonna do. Human Rorschach. Oh. Is it Rachel? Still Rachel? Okay. We're going to form an image, and you are going to tell us what it looks like. Let us know what you see when when they form an ink blot. 
What does that look like, the original? A swan. A swan. Yes, a swan. Yeah, good. Uh, all right. Uh, what, a, what about this one with me and Al? And, uh, <laughs> a blowjob. Oh, yeah. <laughs> a swan and a blowjob. All the makings of a fantastic day at the park. I all think right. that, Oh my god. Oh, I know what it is. A swami. A swami! A swami! swami. swami. Uh, I, I don't know what a swami is. I don't need to pick another word. <laughs> <laughs> Should we make uh, another Walmart shirt? Walmart employee. Walmart employee. A swan and blow job and a Walmart employee. <laughs> Wonderful. What we are now going to do is pull you in the audience into Rachel's subconscious with us. And we're going to poke around until we figure out what to do. <laughs> yes, that's what we're doing. We're going to jump inside of your head and you're going to be there with us. And don't be scared. <laughs> okay, well don't. <laughs> no denial is a problem, okay? Um, so we're, we're going to experience things in your mind. Now, it's very important, I got you a safety box. Um, if you're ever too scared or worried, uh, there's an escape route inside the box. But don't open it unless you want to. Okay, here you go. Um, just careful. If you can figure out how to open it, you win a prize. Um, okay. Great show! <laughs> when dealing in the subconscious, you're gonna see some weird shit. <laughs> so if the shit gets weird in your head, think of better things. High five. No, slower. There we go. <laughs> On the count of three, we are going to dive into her head. One, three, two, two three. three. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, oh my, my god. god, you can't Where see it. What the head? hell is this? Rachel, is this your everyday? Holy shit. <laughs> Look, I see a photo of Rachel on one of those swan boats. Aye, it's a distant memory from childhood. There she is. She's got a parasol, because it's the fucking 1790s America. <laughs> oh no, what is that raining down from the sky? Oh my god. Oh. The, the picture started to rain its watery ocean into the reality of where we are. <laughs> <laughs> We have we have a soggy Rachel and a floppy parasol. Oh. oh wait, Rachel, could this be a first date you're on? I suddenly become you, and I am Rachel. I hello, I am Rachel. Oh, hello, uh, Rachel. I am your date. Yes, hello. <laughs> um, it is very nice meeting you. This is a prime date. Our mother set us up. And yes, um, I said our mother, but I met my mother. <laughs> <laughs> Because in Rachel's mind, that's what happened. Yes. <laughs> honk, honk, feed me bread. Oh! <laughs> okay. It's a goose. Oh, I brought you to the park to feed the goose with the bread. Did I'm, you bring it? I have bread right here. Oh, Eat it, you shit. <laughs> <laughs> now I leave my goosely farm and I become a canopy. Oh, a I a oh, pause, hold on. Canopy? A canopy. It's like a tent, but outside. Oh, thank God. I thought it was like a can full of pee. No, that would be ridiculous. That's goddamn disgusting. Why would you something like that? I'm not good with words. I went to Steven's hand again. Oh, look. We are underneath the canopy holding hands because the first date went so well. Don't. Ooh, I don't like touching like that. Listen, you tell me. Do you want to get married? Yeah! And that's how we broke up. Oh my, <laughs> oh my god. It's a source. Did oh. you break up? Did you take it hard? Denied! No, 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 denial! Denial! <laughs> denial is more than a desert in Egypt, you know. <laughs> We're getting somewhere with this. Wait. In the distance, I see two people getting blowjobs. <laughs> <laughs> they're so happy. 
There are two people getting blowjobs, and there are, of course, two others giving them. <laughs> <laughs> It's like a puzzle box. I guess we'll keep going. <laughs> <laughs> the blowjobs are getting super intense. <laughs> 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 How does that make you yes, feel? Tell us. Do you feel like you can't trust us? Yeah, pretty much. Okay, yeah. good. You passed the first test. All right, now remember, if you get scared, you can open the box again. <laughs> <laughs> Scare us with it. Yes. Okay, the blowjobs went away. All right, there's uh, people giving anal sex over here. <laughs> They're Walmart employees. Yes, it's a Walmart, but it's after hours. It's not a 24 7 Walmart, it closes at 11. It is now 11.30. Ah, uh, yes, with each subsequent thrust, the motion sensing doors they open. <laughs> um, as you vision in this, you start to get an out of body experience, even though your body's not participating in this. Oh, I'm uh, Rachel. I'm yes. floating above my body. Oh, I am a puddle of sticky goo. That's not the normal Walmart. <laughs> 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 it's all Rachel. Oh my god, it's me, Rachel. I've never seen this kind of goo at Walmart before. I should touch it with yeah. my hand. As, as the goo becomes a life form, it becomes um, your, um, your first pet. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a bunny. Feed me bread. <laughs> I, I brought bread to eat it, you shit. <laughs> I bread free of my bunny red Wait, bread. Wait, hold on. The, the titles. What? I've never had a bunny. What? Denial. What? Of Denial. Of <laughs> Rachel, it's not healthy. But you, this is suppressed feelings. You had a bunny. But because of what happens next, you forgot about it. The bunny transforms into a canopy. Oh, <laughs> oh my god. It's, an, it's yes. an outdoor oh tent. And what's happening inside this canopy? Walmart employees are having air yes. sex. But, but then they keep sprouting more Walmart employees, like bunnies multiply. And it keeps going on and on. Soon the ground is just has a bunch of flopping Walmart employees everywhere. <laughs> trying to buy some juice. <laughs> All you want is your daily dose of Minute Maid, and you have to walk through a swamp. I become Rachel walking through the Walmart over the Walmart employees. All like they're, they're like the bunnies. And I am the coveted court of orange juice. Hello. Also out of reach. Hello, welcome to Walmart. Thank you. I'm not interested. No, well, hello, welcome.
The juice opens and a bunch of bats fly out of the juice. It covers the entire vision of your reality. And soon the bats start to disappear and you find yourself somewhere new. It is somewhere that you've not since been since you got your heart broken by Batman. Oh, she's at the local children's theater watching my students put on Boss Baby the Musical. <laughs> I am now Batman. Tremble before my justice, my love, Rachel. <laughs> the spotlight it's shines above them. You stare at the Ooh. Oh, this ah. is getting real. It's therapy is Do working. Do you smell that? It's a breakthrough, right? <laughs> <laughs> All right. There's a spotlight that forms the shape of a heart. Um, it, is, it is the spotlight color that you normally see. Um, and I am that heart. <laughs> <laughs> I want you to do me the honor of becoming my bat wife. Activate bat wife. You have blow jabs. 
You have Walmart, you have Goo, and you have the painting American Gothic. All right, all right, Miss Psychotherapist. <laughs> what is wrong with you now? Yeah, this is my rabbit <laughs> oh, Abandon me, shoes. <laughs> you let it go twice, and now you want it back a third time, huh? Yeah, that's how it goes, you then. Fool me twice, you know? No, continue. No, that's, that's all I had to say. Wow. Is that right? Yeah. All right, see, that's, that's better than a no. That is, right? We're making progress. Now, Rachel, normally this is the part where we jump back into your head and get into the really dark, suppressed stuff. However, we have been informed by our lawyers we are not to do that anymore. <laughs> so we are going to give to you now our diagnostic prognosis. <laughs> okay, Patrice. Yes. Give the diagnostic prognosis. So when we were in your brain, we noticed that you were afraid of swans and blowjobs in Walmart. And that you deny a lot of things like your bunny and, and wanting Batman as your partner. Uh, this tells us that you need to take at least 40 milligrams of uh, Xanax every day and don't call us again because you're a terrible person. Your brain is full of a lot of horrible <laughs> <laughs> I, I think what we need to do is embrace the juice. If you open the juice that you can never find, you will find yourself. <laughs> and look what happens to me drifting from your skull. Oh! It's a carton of juice. Oh, thanks, I was so glad. Uh, no, it's the metaphorical no. juice! <laughs> Patrice, you drank Rachel! You drank metaphorical Rachel! What did she taste like? <laughs> she tasted like Walmart goo. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta clear that out. How would out. you know? <laughs> we, we've been inside you, Rachel. How would you, how would you know <laughs> Rachel, you've got a lot of serious problems. <laughs> Thank you, Rachel. Give Rachel a round of applause. Wait, do we have something for Rachel? We have a certificate of sanity. Okay, well, it's in the green room. We'll bring it to her later. Okay. <laughs> that sounds good. Woo! Rachel, Yay! 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 Woo!